Hey, Jose Martinez here on Project 8 VR installation. <clears throat> Just wanted to talk about real quickly about um, my experience so far going on with this project. Of the yeah, of this project, um, I think he's coming out good. Well, we are taking in some ideas from Ryan McIntosh, me and the group. Um, we're building this like little store, which you know it's it's you could say themed about our our artist Ryan. We're set, we're having some of his pictures going on there. We're having um, um some of his artwork um, posted on there. We're having some some of the things that he has um, printed. You could say prints. I think it's called screen print. Um. <coughs> oh, excuse me. <clears throat> oh yeah, basically um the process of the progress of our our project um we we each we each broke it into into four parts i'm doing the building and the and the little and the little bucket or recycling thing recycling bucket where you could put in your new max and let's say you buy an old one or trying to switch it up and also i want to talk about um the art the reading that we had to do for Eva and Franco. Um, today was about Darko Maver, and he was a really how can I put, creative artist. Let's say that. Um, what he, what he's what he's into it's like death and weird like you could say death scenes, death screenshots, and um, I mean how the first time I saw it I was like did someone actually die? And they call this art, or how is this happening? And and apparently he uses wax or fabric and stuff like that. So I thought it was pretty amazing to actually make it look this real. That is that is impressive. Um, and also when I looked at it, I didn't I didn't really get how most people when they see it they get all disgusted or anything like that. When I when I was reading it, my sister saw it. Just one quick glance of it, and she felt like throwing up according to her. I was like, wow, I was pretty fascinating. Well, I mean, someone trying to study for probably hopefully be a doctor, I, I find it pretty fascinating. <clears throat> also, um, yeah, um, his, his kind of artwork is has to deal with death and brutality, and apparently he got arrested for it because he's basically exposing the brutality of war. No, I don't really understand that. Like, you know, it's just art. I understand that part. It's just art, but when it came to it, it's like I mean, okay, I understand that you're not, um, you know, no one wants to see how it looks like. Let's say if you're dead in the war, no one wants to see that, and I get that, but it's not really them. It's just artwork. It's wax, fabric, anything that he has used. Well, that's what I'm hoping for.